In the early morning hours of December 7th, a scene of chaos and surprise unfolds. Lieutenant Rasmussen, clad in purple pajamas, observes Japanese planes raining destruction on the field. Strapping his .45 caliber pistol to his attire, he races to find an operable airplane. Amidst the wreckage, he discovers an untouched P-36 Hawk. With a lull in the bombing, he seizes the opportunity. Alongside three other pilots, they take off heading towards Kaneohe Bay. A fierce aerial battle ensues, pitting the American pilots against 11 Japanese aircraft. Despite a jammed 30 caliber gun and limited 50 caliber ammunition, Lt. Rasmussen shoots down a Mitsubishi A6M0. Attacks from other Japanese pilots ensue, one of whom attempts a suicidal ram. Despite the damage inflicted, Lt. Rasmussen manages to regain control of his plummeting aircraft, returning to Wheeler Field. Landing with no brakes, rudder, or tailwheel, the aircraft is a sieve of bullet holes, estimated to number around 500. A tale of resilience, courage, and unfathomable determination etched in the annals of history.